Well, we've got a windscreen today for a 2023 Hyundai Tucson. Shush. Um, yeah, a 2023 Tucson. <coughs> and uh, it's very smart. I'll give it that. And the uh, yeah, the, the stereo and that. Well, the infotainment's quite clear, but uh, it's very rough compared to other cars I've driven. It's very rough over bumps, like this little spoon drain. Compared to other cars I've driven, that was quite slow. It's quite rough, and that was only a tiny little spoon drain, or a a water gutter, I guess you could call it, across the road. And when you go over something rough, I can hear something rattling in the dash. Or knocking. And it's only done just shy of 8,500 kilometres. Which is like 3,000 miles, something like that. 3, 4,000 miles, I think. Not a lot. Yeah, it's, it's alright, but, but it's definitely not, uh, not what I'd consider very smooth. My old Commodore is smoother over bumps and bushes. This has got to better power delivery in a smoother fashion than my Commodore. But, uh, yeah, it's definitely... Well, I didn't feel a gear or anything there. But, uh, yeah, it's definitely... I'm not quite as comfortable. I guess that's the drawback because it's not uh, refined like a Japanese or a, a European car. But uh, overall, 2023 Tucson's not a bad car. I'll shift. When, when I park it, I'll show you a little bit in the interior. Alrighty, so we're going to continue inside. Now, I don't know about you, so yes, um, a bit of a continuation. I reckon that looks cheap. Um, I don't see the, the, the fanciness about push buttons. Uh, we have our heated seats. Now, camera for parking purposes, our parking sensors, our hill descent, that being separated from that which is wonderful, they should never be incorporated, that is a dumb idea, there's a lot of piano black though, or pre pretend piano black. You have it all around here, which is all your touch points. It looks cool until you look at it too hard and that happens. More of it on here. I'm not sure why it needs to be there, but anyway. And a dash cluster looks alright. Look up there. Very nice click tactile feel so yeah overall not a bad car for a basic little look at 